Example two looks at a two-tailed test. So long period of time, uh, non-vegetarian meals is two to one. Uh, in Man Manuel's restaurant, uh, a random sample of 10 people ordering meals, one ordered a vegetarian meal. So there's our um, bit of evidence. So uh, two to one, so therefore um, one third of the meals are vegetarian and two thirds are not. So our p-value to be tested is one third. Uh, it says in the question, 5% level of significance test whether or not the proportion of people eating vegetarian meals is different to that in Enrico's restaurants. Okay, so different implying no direction, uh, alternative hypotheses are not equal to. And uh, we set up our binomial. We want this time the probability of our evidence or worse. So when we are setting up our probability statement, we haven't got a direction in the alternative hypotheses to guide us this time. So what we need to do is we need to look at our binomial and look at what we would expect to get. So our expected value for that binomial would be 10 over three. We actually got one. So we look at the probability of one or further away from 10 over three. So our direction is a less than or equal to. Again, you can just pick that probability up from your calculator. Don't need to use the formula to work it out. And there's your probability. And um, because it's a two-tailed test, we compare with half of the significance level. So we make our comparison with half of the significance level. Again, our probability is greater than the significance level. So there is insufficient evidence to reject H0. Uh, there's no evidence that the proportion of people eating vegetarian meals at Manuel's restaurant is different than Enrico's. And the p-value for the test. And finally, the p-value uh, for the test is always just, uh, in the case of a two-tailed test, double the probability. So the p-value represents the probability uh, that you've found to compare with your significance level. Um, in a one-tailed test, it's just that. In a two-tailed test, because uh, your significance level is twice as big, you basically just double the, uh, the p-value to for um, a two-tailed test.